RX Museum is a weekly reflection on the intersection of art and medicine. Brought to you by Penn Medicine, Barnes Foundation, Slot Foundation, the Philadelphia Museum of Art, and the Health Ecologies Lab. Every Monday for a year, subscribers receive an artwork in their inbox, accompanied by insightful commentary about medicine as a humanistic practice. I'm an assistant professor in the Department of Anesthesiology and Critical Care. Prior to the pandemic, I hosted several arts and medicine workshops at the Philadelphia Museum of Art and the Barnes Foundation. And I was always amazed at the dialogue that would naturally emerge in the galleries amongst peers and colleagues, predicated on a willingness to be open and share common experiences that often go unacknowledged. The RX Museum Initiative is a natural extension of my interest in physician wellness, building relationships across the spectrum of training at Penn, and facilitating durational engagement and accessibility to the visual arts at Penn Medicine. Hi, I'm a faculty member in the Department of English and History of Art at the University of Pennsylvania, and I'm the Director and Curator of SLOT, where I work at the intersection of art and health. The Arts Museum Initiative is an extension of my interest in the medical humanities and the largely untapped potential of the arts and humanities to positively impact healing and the patient and clinician experience. In our earliest conversations about this project, we reflected on the impact of pain, struggle, suffering, and trauma, both one's own and that of one's community, on one's ability to express oneself, uh, to stay positive, to care for oneself and those around one, but also to contribute to the social life of one's community. Arts Museum, then, is an intervention that seeks to harness the therapeutic power of the arts and humanities to address these crises, crises of communication, crises of connection. Another starting point for this project was that we often forget just how much the arts and humanities and medicine share with each other. Both fields see their work as a form of caregiving, for people, for communities, for memories, and for ideals, and both seek to heal the communities that they are part of. So this project is really exciting for us insofar as it has the potential to positively impact not only these issues, but also the Penn Medicine community and the broader healthcare community as well. We were excited to launch this project amidst the pandemic, recognizing the challenges that providers and caregivers are facing right now. We're also trying to develop a common language that doesn't just span the humanities and the arts and medicine, but also spans different museums and cultural institutions who all have very different ideas of what arts education means and how to go about teaching the arts or encouraging people to love and pursue the arts. It's more than a project, it's a series of relationships that has brought a lot of joy into our lives. We've had the opportunity to work with students on this project throughout, and many have stayed involved long after the initial exposure through the classroom ended. Hello, my name is Ivy Liu, and I'm a senior at the University of Pennsylvania, as well as a member of the RX Museum editorial team. Working on this project has really filled a gap in my own education by allowing me to contemplate culturally conscious care, not only in my role as a future practitioner, um, but just as a humanitarian and citizen. As a collaborative team of faculty and students, clinicians and museum educators, we are committed to unpacking the art historical, the sociopolitical, and the medical implications of each artwork we engage. This is a unique challenge that has required us to work as a team as we extend beyond our own socializations and the disciplines that have formed us. We have observed that many providers are incredibly excited about engaging the arts, as well as issues of equity and justice, but they're often intimidated or simply don't know where to begin. So through this deft weaving of art history with contemporary reflection in a medical context, we're really trying to democratize the arts and to render them more accessible but also to translate the humanities into practical and useful applications. We invite you to join us in this work. Since our launch in the summer of 2020, RX Museum has elicited interest from over 1,000 weekly subscribers consisting of Penn clinicians, trainees and students, as well as clinicians and other individuals from external institutions. 
Forthcoming expansions include integration with Cobalt, a mental health resource for Penn Medicine staff and providers and the broader Penn community, and further incorporating RX Museum content into several Penn undergraduate course curricula. Moving forward, we hope to more rigorously assess the impact of durational engagement with the arts, not just with respect to clinician wellness, but also in fostering compassion, integrity, and respect for diverse patient populations and cultivating a greater accountability to society and medicine. We see this as a longitudinal conversation, and we invite anyone interested to visit us at rxmuseum.org or reach out to us at info at rxmuseum.org.